Hey guys, Michael Valentino from Crusader Caravans in Campbell for Victoria, and today I'm pleased to share with you we have just received a Chameleon Liberty SV second hand, only 12 months old, just under 12 months old, ready to go. It's just hit the lot, it's clean as, she's ready to roll, she's got a heap of extras on it. We're gonna walk you through this today, but this van is ready to go as of July 2022. Just give us a call. If you want to be able to pick her up, you want to be able to get the handover, we show you the full detailed instructions of where to go on the whole unit. You know, I have a full service check and all appliance working, still under manufacturer warranty. Let's go, I'll show you our brand new one. So this guy here comes with a six inch A-frame all the way back to the drawbar. Six inch as identified here, back to the wheels. We have a DO35 Cruise Master coupling. We have a front rotating jockey wheel, easy as that. She's all lit up currently, we've got our test box on. It runs a seven pin flat with gray Anderson 50 amp plug. Spare wheel holder, still tire cover intact, nice and clean. We have our nine kilo gas bottle, full upon pickup. A diesel heater uh, fuel holder at the front there, bolted up. This guy runs straight through the diesel heater. I think it's probably had two uses. It's absolutely brand new. We have a toolbox on the front of the van. We have a Weber Q slide like so. Weber Q goes in like that, nice and easy to use, and stores away nice and snug. Jerry can either side of the uh, toolbox, and a heap of room we can mount by, uh, bikes, fire boxes, whatever you need. On the front here, we've got two 170 watt solar panels with a Dometic HB optional extra aerial on that with a 24 inch DVD TV combo. We also have a number nine tunnel boot door with annex light above for outside cooking. Of course, it comes with the DO35 pin. The weights on this are tearing at 14.55, ball weight of 147 with an ATM of 27. Realistically, we give you a heap of payload. You've got a 1200 plus kilo payload. Of course, you don't need that in a van this big, but it gives you that option if you've got a three and a half, two and a half ton vehicle, but a van or car uh, with the capacity of around about 21, 22 towing, you're gonna be spot on with it. We have our Swift cooktop with our two burner, uh, griller as well as um, heating area. This guy pops on there. We've got our heat indicator, our uh, hot and cold water here with our quick fit hookups. Um, we've got a hot and cold water tap as well as gas bayonet underneath there. This guy here, when you're done cooking, packs away nice and snug and locks away. Inside the boot here, tucked to the side, we've got a stone stopper. A stone stopper traditionally in the caravan industry is a uh, rock protection device that hangs from the vehicle back to the caravan. These guys actually got this fitted um, and uh, they've since upgraded to a larger van, hence the changeover. This stone stomper stays with this because it's a particular design layout for this particular chameleon. Um, these are valued at roughly about $1,000. It comes with all of your grey water hose and carrier, electric cable carrier, fresh water drinking hose and carrier. Everything's ready to go, not a thing to buy, you're loaded. You've got uh, our off-road wheels and tyres. These guys are 16-inch 245 wheels and tyres with an independent trailing arm suspension from Tough Ride. All Australian made chassis, all Australian made wheels, uh, all Australian made suspension. Our jacking points, checker plate wheel flares. We have a 240 outlet plug on the outside, our clearance lights, external speakers, annex lights front, rear, everywhere. We have our double glazed Dometic windows from uh, Dometic, of course. We have our Fiyama wind out awning, I believe it's about a 2.5 meter. We also have a special insole on this particular unit when these guys pick it up. We have a rear wind out awning with uh, annex light there at the back. This just keeps the rain off the door in event of a little bit of more, uh, a little bit of rain when you're going from the back of the car into the caravan with all your groceries or or uh, all of your fit outs for your camping. We've got a wireless camera with grab handle for easy lift into the van. We have a trim safe door on the back here, fully protected all the heaters on in there. It's pretty amazing. We have a double step. Uh, with the Chameleon, easy in. We have four stabilizer legs all across the caravan for easy, of sta uh, easy stabilizer. The van, of course, comes with 12 month registration, our clearance lights at the back, as well as LED lights throughout. Our toilet, clean, of course, with our filling station. So that's a combination shower and toilet for this particular guy. Fully insulated composite build. We have our fridge vent, our power inlet, our circuit breakers. We have our grey water protection, our diesel heater uh, exhaust. We have our grey water point, our main hookup point, uh, Crusader uh, mud guards, as well as our 16 inch tyres across. Two 95 litre water tanks underneath this guy. We have a 28 litre stainless steel gas and 240 Australian made Swift hot water service unit. We have two batteries, 120 amp AGMs, all kitted out with breakers, of course. 
ready to roll, free cam ready. Storage. Our stone stopper fit out a pole. Don't know what that's for, but a pole. We also have our Kami breakaway unit as well as projector uh, PM200 charging system. Uh, on this side here, we have a generator slide. So generator, Weber Q, heap of gear. There literally isn't a thing you need to be able to add to this van to hook it up. Maybe a generator, maybe a Weber Q, depending on your cooking preference. But you've got the slide out kitchen, so you're all fitted out, ready to roll. The van will be fully tested to make sure that everything's working, uh, gone all over, it'll have its full service regime before she hits the road so you can have confidence for the next 12 months you won't have to worry about a thing. Let me show you the inside. On the inside of the van it features an island kitchen bench on the left hand side of the unit. It features a grey and brown interior or brown flooring. We have, oh she's warm in here. So we have a two kilowatt diesel heater from Diesel Heat in Tasmania that is roaring and I'm going to turn it off before I'm sick because this is way too hot. Whew. All right, we have a Bel Air air conditioner for hot and uh, for heating and cooling. It's a true reverse cycle unit, a full island bench with Dometic cooktop, two burners, hot and cold water at our sink. We have our range hood ready to blast hot and cold air. We have full storage on all of our cupboards. You can have a look in the cupboards. There isn't a speck of wear. Like these guys have done nothing with the van. Um, COVID, you know, all that. Um, you've got your full storage in here, of course. And I think they've left an iPhone cable. <laughs> ready for charging. Uh, we have our radio with inside and outside speakers. We have our Thetford uh, fridge. This guy runs at about 110 litres, I believe. You've got these awesome little pockets everywhere throughout the caravan. They've added all of these with their remote holders, left two stubby holders. We've got our stone stopper instructions, pack down list. Uh, inside, it comes with all of the manuals ready to roll. I don't even think these guys have got, it's coming with sealed packages. I haven't even opened a thing. We've got our cupboards underneath here with a few custom fit outs for shelves that they've happened to install. Now, the bed fit out in this guy is two single beds. It also comes with the ability to be able to drop down um, a little board between the beds and then you can push the beds together. I'm just gonna pop this. We're gonna pop the beds together and then you actually have a, a separate part that you could put the beds together and you have a full queen, almost king size mattress. Not needed, of course. They've obviously gone to that extra mile but it gives you a little bit of versatility. Now you've got, most importantly, a 24 inch TV DVD combo. Um, easy to make a smart, you pop a little fire stick in there and it's gonna fire them up to be a smart. Inside and outside speaker switches. We also have a table valued at about $650 worth of an optional extra inside so you can have a little bit of eating area. Um, it also spins around so it's full 360 and quickly removed with a little um, access point underneath there, so you undo them. Sirocco fans either side. Again, you've got these magazine pouches. These are valued about $150 each, um, looking at caravan fitment. We have our wind-up aerial that lays flat upon travel. Um, there's a heap of storage under here. There's a heap of storage under here. It is a full fit-out little van. The weight on these is about 18 months, and the price has gone up significantly. Um, but this is your chance to be able to get a Chameleon Liberty SV full off-road unit ready to go, handover included. You can have the assurance that it's up to speed, nothing's wrong, everything's hunky-dory. As I said, still caravanning around the country, but these guys have just optioned up for that little bit bigger van. Um, they've had their time and they're, they're looking to get something bigger. I'll let our lovely camera lady come around here. We've got our combination shower and toilet with a storage bag for our shower head. Oh, actually it smells pretty good in here. These guys are looked after it. We have fan in and out. We have up and down exhaust fan. We have our mirror shower door. Combination shower toilet unit. We have an overhead cupboard with all of our bits and pieces in there. Shower curtain to protect the toilet, as well as our toilet, of course. Cleaned out, ready to roll. These guys have really looked after it. They're seriously, the amount of work um, they've gone into looking after this is just spectacular. Um, last but not least, um, everything will be checked, gone over. You'll be well covered as far as buying from Crusader Melbourne. The windows, block out, midgy proof screens, click out aerials. That click out window, one, two, three, and back in. So as I said, everything in this van is fully operational. Everything's been gone over, under, on the hoist, service check, the whole lot. If you'd like to find out more about it or leave us a deposit to be able to take this guy on the next adventure, give us a call on 93592938. Alternatively, send me an email asking us, michael at crusadermelbourne.com. Head to the website where it should be listed. But for more information, guys, like and subscribe for the next one. It won't last long. We'll see you soon.